State law requires drivers to move over for stopped emergency responders and maintenance vehicles, but still many people don't do it. Yeah, our Samuel King joins us now with a reminder, Sam, the consequences if you don't can be deadly. And Steve in Myra, AAA says nationwide an emergency responder is killed every other week on average after being struck. And a survey from the AAA, AAA Traffic Safety Foundation found that many people don't realize how dangerous that behavior can be. Almost a quarter were unaware of the move over law in their state and 42% of respondents who don't comply all the time with the law thought it was only somewhat dangerous or not dangerous at all not to move over. It's not just dangerous for emergency responders or law enforcement. Between 2015 and 2019, Texas led the nation in the number of fatalities of people who were struck while they're outside a disabled vehicle. You want to pay attention, really, no matter what the situation is, no matter uh, what road you're on, whether that be a highway, you know, in a construction zone or, you know, on a side street or a rural road. Uh, you know, there can be hazards anywhere uh, along the roads. And so Texas law requires you to move over or slow down by 20 miles under the posted speed limit when an emergency or maintenance vehicle is pulled over. You should remain alert, avoid distractions, focus on driver as Josh, uh, driving as Josh Rizuba was saving. Keep an eye out for emergency vehicles. This also applies to tow trucks, utility service vehicles, and disabled vehicles on the side of the road. Of course, when you see the situation, slow down and move away from the people on the vehicles at the side of the road. All very important information to keep in mind to keep people safe, especially as people hit the roads for the upcoming holidays.